Through lingering winters and brief summers, the surrounding sea claims sovereignty, isolating the tiny archipelago of St. Pierre and Miquelon. Here, the Baffin Current carries ice around the southern tip of Newfoundland to sail off the islands in winter. And in summer, the cold waters still carrying a rumor of Arctic ice merge with warmer waters to enshroud the islands in fog. Such is how the sea around them begins, and such is its setting. In the early days of World War II, ice and warfare in the North Atlantic keeps the usual freighter from delivering supplies to this tiny outpost of France. All the islanders are in desperate need of liberation from their Vichy overlords. None more so than Jerome Sabot, who battles to suppress crippling memories of World War I battlefields, but whose courage must be challenged anew if he's to save those he holds dear. Or Adrian Cormier, who longs to escape her abusive husband and sail off with her lover but who harbors a stunning secret that might make everything impossible. Or young Marie Lisette Morel, who fantasizes of far-off places and adventures, but who must face a real wartime adventure for which she will need uncommon courage. The sea around them is a story of how people struggle for redemption and liberation. And it's a story of the magic that can happen when the northern lights dance in the night sky. <laughs>